energy vibration reading for the Gemini Sun Moon and Rising it is the 11th week it's a duality week please be aware of this things will be happening in twos for you guys uh, it's gonna be a wonderful week um, um, for you guys thank you for your support your likes and shares please remember to likes and share these videos okay um, I want to say to each and every person this week is going to be a week of a lot of blessings coming in a lot of um, surprising things but um, in a good positive way please likes and share these videos listen to your Sun Moon and rising sign here we go let's see what's happening for Monday the week is going to begin from um, the week is going to bring begin from the um, not the 12th until the 18th and um, um, beginning the week from the 12th till the 18th then we're going to have the energies that are coming in on Monday you have the energy of the wheel of fortune this is going to be good this is going to be a positive energy because the energy of the week is the full new beginnings but we have duality so there's a lot of new beginnings. so it could be new the beginnings that is coming in in um, love money relationships um, friendships um, um, you know positive energies uh, um, in ways that you weren't expecting it's like a lucky week um, a lot of um, successful but luck coming in on Monday in duality in twos um, Tuesday positive energy um, the energy of the air event which is wonderful um, this energy of the air event is a good positive energy because it has to do with organization and groups this is um, the energy of the fool which is the um, energy of this week so this is good it's coming in on Wednesday so new start with an organization or that sort of a thing on Thursday you have the nine of water good because the nine of water have been coming up where a lot of you air sign it's gonna be a very very lucky week so that's a wonderful and let's see what's happening on Friday on Friday you have the energy of the hermit this Friday you are going to be looking for inner wisdom and guidance you always find that because you're always open up okay then we have the energy of strength on Saturday whatever the situation is um, there is going to you need a, um, a lot of strength to move forward and then you have the energy on Sunday of um, the king of earth coming back up so a lot of you are going to be working the energy of the king of earth um, I'm seeing the king of earth so um, this can be a woman or a man over the age of 40 that is coming in uh, to work with you guys it doesn't have to be over the age of 40 because this week is a du duality week so you will have young people coming in in the form of kings and queen okay so your outcomes is the eight of swords eight of swords is that you're trying to figure out certain things and situation in your life um, you're not seeing clearly to a lot of situations in your life you Germanize in this week but because you want a new start and it's as if this new start you're not seeing how you can make this new start happen okay so let's um, go forward and, and take a look at your week um, the weekend is is where I, you the weekend you need to find inner strength with um, someone who is or is um, a woman who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn or a, a man who is a Taurus Virgo and Capricorn in this week let's look at the Wheel of Fortune and an organization what is happening with this Wheel of Fortune and the organization um, you're trying to plant something you're trying to make something happen for you you're trying to make something work for you you're trying to work with an organization to bring forward something okay then you have the energy of I'm sorry I have to put my glasses on we have the energy of the king of cups in the middle of the week this king of cups um, has something to do with the organization um, is a new start um, um, you're gonna have a new start with this King of Cups in an organization, whatever that is. Um, but you're trying in a uh, in a strength to do this new start. You're you're really trying to find inner strength to have this new start with this person. Um, 
and the energy of the love is coming up and this is going to be good because um, for you um, Gemini this is your sign um, you Gemini's this is the energy of love you carry the energy vibration of love and there's a new start um, for you guys in love and this is what you have been always and wishing for this new start for you Gemini's is with um, someone who is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn or some um, a man or a woman this and, and this is what you have been always wanted okay then we have the energy of the hermit and strength um, and information comes in um, you're going to look within and find wisdom and understanding with the energy of um, the page information is coming in to you from an organization and um, you're going to find um, wisdom and strength um, to go forward okay then we have with strength and the king of wands um, it's gonna be good you guys have the energy of the star and this is good because a whole lot of you air people are having the energy of the star which is just so wonderful and positive so the wheel of fortune um, the wheel of fortune is coming in and it's bringing a lot of wisdom and guidance and inner information what you weren't aware of that is coming in and this is good because what is happening is that you're understanding a situation with the organization so the first half of the week it is the energy of the wheel of fortune coming twice oh my god you guys are so lucky oh my gosh this is so positive you guys this is this is extremely positive um you have the energy of the wheel of fortune twice this is so good so the first half of the week for a lot of you there is fortune there is a lot of fortunate situation there's a lot of luck wheel of fortune a lot of luck coming in for you guys and information is going to be coming at you about this so is it if it's a lucky break for you um, um, Gemini's in the beginning of the week it's going to be a very very lucky break because um, a lack something new and positive is coming in and um, with this positive energy because it has to do with um, a group of people that is you know seeing you seeing what you're doing and the work that you have done and that sort of a thing and this is there's communication that is going to be coming to you and this is going to be in a positive way as we look at the middle of the week there is a situation that you have with a king of cups in the middle of the week and the five of Pentacles so whatever this is whatever that is it has a situation some of you could be dealing with the situation with the king of cups and whatever your the situation is it's as if um, you are with this person and you're trying to figure out and work out the situation you're finding in a strength to deal with this deal with whatever is coming at you whether you felt as if this person have left you in the cold or whether you felt as if you know this person have worked against you in whatever situation or whatever way but you know things is happening for you and um, um, it's as if um, the wheel of fortune is, is bringing um, positive energy towards you and is going to help you out of a situation um, you have um, temperance some of you um, who are in relationship with, with a Virgo um, with a man or woman it's they're going to be bringing you a lot of luck they're going to be bringing you a lot of luck okay so if you're working with a Virgo um, person um, they're going to be bringing you really a lot of luck whatever is happening whatever situation is taking place whatever situation is transpiring this Virgo person is going to bring you a lot of luck um, because um, as, as if if um, you're going to start a new relationship or you're going to get married to this earth sign person and it is a Virgo um, I'm seeing a Virgo is going to bring you a lot of luck whatever the situation is a Virgo is going to really really bring you a lot of luck you're trying to balance out certain aspects and certain situations in your life some of you are going to be connecting with the Queen of King of Pentacle of, of, of Cups which is um, 
a Pisces or a Cancer or a Scorpion and this is going to be good because whatever the situation is whatever that is going on it's going to be extremely positive because what is going to happen is that new positive energies are coming out okay so I need to look at something because I'm seeing the five of Pentacles the hardship and it's as if that is the energy but then the wheel of fortune is around it so let's see what exactly is that saying um, listen to your intuition guidance and it's gonna be okay it is going to be okay not to worry about what is happening it's as if um, there's a situation where um, some transformation is happening because it's a week of transformation there's just so many duality that is working out in this week whenever the energy of the moon is in it can be emotional it can be people connecting together with each other um, but this is really a karmatic emotional burden challenges um, emotional burden and channel challenge and with creative project for some people so it could be but not to worry because it is going to be okay you know not to worry because it's as if a new life is as if someone out there has been trying to do something very creative and it's as if you have been um, getting these blocks or these obstacles and you need to pray you need to ask the universe you need to say look um I need help with the situation I need um, uh, the wheel of fortune to bring me success in my endeavor in what I am trying to do so whatever that is you know happening um, you need to really um, bring a positive sense to whatever the situation is it's gonna be good <laughs> it is going to be good so not to worry it's gonna be good um, this situation is going to come out in a perfect way so for love love is going to be good for you guys you have um, you have no need to worry what is it transpiring and happening in your life um, the last part of the week is going to be very good because the star energies are here with the energies of the Sun love is going to be wonderful for you guys in this week you have nothing to worry about with love and we are going to see what other energies are here for you guys orphaned some of you are really feeling as if you're alone and you're down and out and you're in the cold and that sort of a thing release yourself of this because it's all going to be over because what is happening is that you're not seeing a situation clear it's as if you're trying to go through and figure out what exactly is happening but not to worry because the energy of the Sun is coming out okay because whenever you have the energy of the star um, that is there with the Sun coming that mean positive situation um, the energy of the star is always dreams your reality and encouragement movement moving forward and that sort of a thing and it's um, moving forward in a very positive way um, there's a going to be a big win for some of you honest uh, a big win is coming up for some of you so you know don't feel so alone and uh, you know in yourself because there's a big win that is coming out I want to say please remember to listen to the Sun Moon Horizon sign and I want to say namaste until next time